Hello everyone, um, welcome back or welcome if it's your first video you're watching. If this is the first video you're watching then um, things may seem a bit like, oh, what does she mean? If you're not sure, feel free to comment um, or um, things should be explained in my previous videos unless I go off on a tangent. So this is a very quick, quick check-in. Uh, this month did not go as planned. It's my first month uh, uploading and budgeting on YouTube. Yep, it is. Budget changes, income changes. Oh, it's been a bit chaotic and all over the place. A bit like my brain at the moment. Um, But, so it's not gone as planned. I haven't tracked this week. I haven't tracked my spending. I kind of kept a mental thing, but you know what it's like? It's much better if you write it down. It holds you more accountable. This is what this channel is for because I do weeks like this where I don't track. Um, and now I'm changing my budget because I got a bit flustered and a bit confused and I just felt really overwhelmed. So um, this week I haven't gone massively over budget. I did take, um, I think it was £25 out of my sinking funds. Uh, we got a takeaway and for laminating envelopes. Um, yeah. Um, but the thing I have noticed is, although I didn't, well, it's hard because I had like little excesses of money um, from my big one-off payment from the disability benefit, which is part of the reason why I didn't actually write it down and track because, again, get confused and flustered already. Not going to be a pretty sight. Um, but I think generally I was within budget in my categories. Spending I might have gone a little bit over on, but the... Things like travel and electric, I was in or under. Travel, I was under budget, but the money went elsewhere to like eating out, which I hadn't budgeted for. So yeah, not great, but that is my weekly check-in. But I do actually have money left in my purse. Where is it? Love this, but I'm still getting to grips with what side is what. So... I just wanted to pop on and do a quick savings challenge with you. So here I have two, four, five, six, seven pound, five, seven pound, seven, seven pound, nine. Wow, I've never had this much change to stuff before because I am a bit lax when I have coins. I tend to think, oh, it won't matter. I'll just take two pound from this envelope i'll just take 50p from this envelope so i am chuffed with that um that's a pretty two pound coin i don't know if you can see it or not i wonder what that is i might be holding it upside down hmm. anyway so if you've watched my channel before you know that i take my two peas out and i set them to one side because i live not too far from the seaside so it's just nice to have that i'm sorry if you can hear motorbikes whizzing past we i live in a very big road with lots of flats and there is always justy and deliverer and all that always up and down and prime seems to live here the prime fans um my window is open in my bedroom and it seems quiet the grass cutters have been and gone uh, <laughs> so yeah i'm sorry if there's any um noise in the background so yeah 4p put that to one side arcades 2p machines job done so then i have seven five left now if you've just watched my other video or the one that's coming up next depending on the order that's uploaded i've updated my savings fund folder and i have my penny savings challenge which is this jar that i've been doing for a total of 670 which is going to go in my emergency fund when it's done and i feel like i'm if you see the black that's the ones i've already filled in i started this in january and i've just chucked in the change that i've had each week at the end you can do it you put aside an amount a day it's a 365 you meant to do it in th yeah the highest amount is three pound 65 and then there's a bonus one of two pound and five p to round it up to an even number first january i'm really pleased with myself i feel like i've done well so some of it is going to go to this but if we skip to the back i have a savings challenge folder 
and I bought some beautiful savings challenges. I have another one in A4. Do I have it to hand? No, it's a big A4 puzzle. And uh, these are from Simple Budgets. If I just said that, I apologise. They're just gorgeous, but they're low income savings. It's not put £10 away here or anything else. The highest is a fiver. I can live with that. So I'm thinking I might start this one. And I really, I don't know, I suppose you can do what you want. Part of me is like, I want to start on the outside or I want to start in the middle. I'm going to start in the middle. So I'm going to take £2 and just colour it in. Does anyone else find colouring really relaxing and a little bit therapeutic? I do. I love it, but I just don't ever make time for it. And I really should, because me and my daughter, we sit on the sofa and we always have TV shows that we're watching of an evening. And I should just make the time to sit in colour while we're watching them. So, yeah, I love it. And I'm going to put £2 in here for that savings challenge. Oh, it feels so good because I don't want to rush this one i'm going to keep going and i'm going to because it's my emergency fund i do want it done but this is a nice smaller amount and because it's in my savings challenge when i finish it i can decide what i want to do with it because i do have dedicated savings challenges in here like for christmas but this one is to do and i have some in my sinking funds to help stuff my sinking funds folder to give me ideas of totals for each month Please check out my other video going through my new budgeting method. But yeah, so I'm really happy with that. And then we want to go to the front. <laughs> I'm not used to having this in here yet. I used to have a big A4 one I was ticking off. So, can't get the pen out. Trying to be organised. And well, where does that get you? So, here I have two, three, four, five, pound five. So let's go to the bigger numbers on the other side, get some of these cleared. Unfortunately, I do not have £3.65, but have I got 40p done? I have not done 40p, so I could put £4.05p and five in, or just £4.35, and do 35 Senate, leave me. What else have I got? One I've done. But I haven't done one. Five. Okay, let's do. Right, I'm doing this off the top of my head. Oh, there's a calculator here. I put a load of stuff next to me because I am now in my room. I'm not on the shaky table where all the cats are. I can shove myself in my room and um, have a bit of peace. So they might break in actually. I have clever cats. My door's not that good, so they come in and break the door down. So we have two pound, uh, one, two, three, and then five p, three, five, five, five. So let's take away three. You can't see that. Sixty-five equals one pound forty. How does that work out? Oh, because I had the five p. Okay. So I, I am colouring it in. I just realised it was out of shot. Is that right? I'm going to have to check that later. And it probably is. How can you get it wrong on a calculator? Don't trust my adding. Because it will not be right. <laughs> oh, it's because I was going to do more squares. Oh, well, that's fine. It's two. And I got the biggest one ticked off. So I am happy. And I love, i tell you what, considering this is a penny challenge, I love seeing all the pennies. And I love seeing the pounds in there as well and all the different change. Because I see that and I'm like, oh, that's so good. Because I'm only, I am only really ever had 1p, 2p, 5p and 10p jars and maybe a 20p. So... Yes, I'm sorry my hands are so up close. I did zoom out. I think I'm sat further away today, so it's like... Rrr. But yes. Um, so yeah, I'm really pleased with how that's coming along. I'm excited to have started my new one. 
yeah it'll be really good so thank you for watching everyone that was my quick chatty week four check-in and also my savings challenge because i had that change uh, if i didn't have that change i may not have done the quick brief check-in overview um stay tuned on my channel if you enjoyed this video because i've put up a couple already this week i've just filmed one i filmed this one i probably won't get time to film my next one until later on today because i have a friend popping around for a coffee in about 20 minutes <laughs> 20 minutes Ooh, 15 um so yeah i've got upcoming uh my march week two budget and then i'm going to do tomorrow i get paid so uh there'll be some cash stuffing and i'm also going to do a meal plan and um like food shopping i've realized my phone camera can pause so that's handy because i don't know how to edit videos i'm not tech savvy but i can pause and carry on recording that's fine um and then hopefully putting the meals up will hold me accountable right thank you all for watching if you like then please feel free to subscribe like my video and comment i really appreciate your comments if i don't reply straight away then i I'm sorry, but I will reply, always reply, even if it takes me a couple of days. Sometimes the notifications don't come through to my phone. Um, and I'm really sorry if you get a reply in the middle of the night, like 2 a.m. I think I was doing that on Instagram and YouTube the other night. Um, so, yeah, I hope you're OK. I hope you are safe, happy and healthy. If not, I hope things look up for you soon. Bye, guys. Take care.